Hi friends, today at the request of some of my friends and subscribers I'm going to talk about the rules of Kirchhoff. We will talk about branched electric circuit which direct current. The two Kirchhoff's rules one simple uh, and the other slightly more complex. So the first rule of Kirchhoff. This is the simplest rule and it sounds like this. The algebraic sum of the force of the currents entering the node is zero. Um, as much uh, current flows in, so much flows out. Usually the currents that flow into the node are positive, those that flow out of the node are negative. This is a consequence of the law of uh, conservation of electric charge. Uh, you can write down this law any way you want. Kirchhoff's second law is more complex. Um, in sound like this, the algebraic sum of voltage drops on a given section of an electric circuit is uh, equal to the al algebraic sum of EMF and uh, on a given section of an electric circuit. This seems very difficult and incomprehensible to most students. Uh, let's make this rule clear. Uh, to do this I made two drivings which EMF serves and internal resistance. So let's go deal with this. The first thing we do we choose the direction of the contour traversal. I choose clockwise but you can also choose counterclockwise. Uh, if you go in the direction of circumventing the contour and get a minus uh, on a plus, uh, then put a plus in in front of the EMF circle. You sort of go up and put a plus sign. If you are going downhill in the direction of uh, the control bypass, then you put a minus sign. Um, so uh, if the direction of current in the loop uh, coincides with the direction of the loop bypass, then you put plus sign. Uh, otherwise, you put a minus sign. It's difficult, I know. Let's solve the problem and see how it works in uh, practice. Here is a simple task if you wish you need to find the strength of the currents. So the first thing we do choosing the direction of the counter bypass. I like to choose clockwise. After that, choose the direction of the currents. You can choose it as you want. Mm, I choose this as follows. E1, I1. I1. And uh, I2. I3 
Now we can clearly see which car is entered to the node and which ones exit. Let's write down the first Kirchhoff occasion. Now we have uh, to choose two independent counters and write the second Kirchhoff equation for each independent counter. Primary circuit, let it be on the left. The current strange uh, is uh, opposite the loop uh, bypass direction. So we put a minus sign. We are going downhill, so we also put a minus in in front of the AMF. In the second case, which we have on the right of the direction of the bypass, can side which the direction of the counter bypass. We have obtained a system of equation that can be solved, for example, by substantiation or addition. I turn the music up and start the site.
So my friends, we have the answers. In some case, the currents may be negative. This will not be our mistake. You must indicate in the response that the selected car and direction does not correspond of the true one. Thank you for your attention. Until the next project, good luck and don't get sick. Sincerely, Yuri Kovalenok.